Hi, I'm Wayne the Boat Guy, and in this video I'm going to talk about how to start a fuel-injected inboard-outboard boat. The very first thing you want to do is turn on your blower. Why that is important is if there is any fuel vapors that exist in your engine compartment, it's a kind of sealed off area. Not completely 100% sealed, but gas vapors can build up in there. You want to run that blower for a few minutes before you even start your motor. So that's the first thing I do before I'm heading out, is I turn on my blower and let the blower run. That blower is not going to run your battery down. If your battery is so low that running the blower for a couple minutes makes it so that your boat can't start, well, you need to be looking at getting a better battery solution. Verify that your boat is locked in neutral. Because it's a fuel injected engine, you don't need to preset the shifter to be able to have an idle speed. You don't need to choke it. And you don't need to force any fuel into the carburetor because it's a fuel injected engine. It will squirt fuel in on its own. Then the next thing you do, turn your key. And in my boat, there's a couple of different alarms. That's the low oil alarm and my depth. And then crank it over, just like you would a modern car. Until the engine kicks. And then once you've gotten out of your marina and you're heading down a little ways, you can turn your blower off. So it's pretty straightforward starting a modern fuel-injected inboard-outboard boat. Oh, and by the way, if you're a subscriber, thank you so much for subscribing. If you're not a subscriber, please take a moment and subscribe. By subscribing to my channel and ringing that bell, you're getting notified whenever I have new videos that come out. And also by subscribing to my channel, you're not committing to anything. You're just letting me know that you appreciate the type of content that I'm making so that I can continue to make more videos for you. So one of the most important things is to make sure that you're always running that blower whenever you start your engine so that way you do not have an explosion or a fire in your engine compartment because that could sink your boat. Thanks for watching. Here's a playlist of some other videos geared to new boaters and another video picked specially for you. Stay safe on the water.